Welcome back to the Gentleman Ultras YouTube channel. I'm Richard Hall. If you can see by my eyes, it's a miracle I'm even doing this, but I had to. Um, there's no secret, obviously, I'm an Inter fan, um, but I, just, I wanted to talk about the paper headline, well, the headlines today, um, because obviously it's um, obviously it's all about Inter, and it's me it, it is a memorable moment. It's a massively huge moment. I, again. There was no head the papers yesterday, as I said, um, so I talked a little bit, and so this may be somewhat repetitive, so I apologise in advance for that. Um, you know, you look at Inter and where they are now, and it's it's huge. Um, obviously, as long as the ownership situation is sorted, Conte has been quoted as saying that Inter play modern football, um, and that the way he's developed the team in his image is is impressive for him. And he's right. Um, again, I, I have to do this. I have to. I know that Inter fans might not like this very much, but you have to pay so much credit to Juventus for setting the bar so high. And for Inter to have to come back and to do what they've had to do is incredible. Um, and that's why this success is so big for me personally. I've said it a million times on here and I say it again. I was a kid, when I was a kid, you know, I was lucky, really lucky, you know, to be able to watch B Sky B, watch the build up to Italian 90 have that shirt that my dad brought back from Milan. It was massive. Um, my life has revolved around Milan, um, for, for better and for worse, I'll tell you that much. And But it's like, I mean, I, and I'm only talking from a fan in the UK, I mean, God knows what those guys in, in Milan feel. You know, because like, when you grow up and you see that success, and it is sandwiched between the two sides, I mentioned yesterday with the Napoli and the, and the Milan, and you, you take the whole situation and you look and it's always thinking legacy, 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 never legacy, apart from that spats from 2006. But even in 2006, seven, even when Europe was on the curve, you know, you look and you're thinking, mm. is it going to have this monumental, how can you put it, you know, is it going to have a 10 year reign? Never think that with NT, you never think it ever. Now this is the first time when you do think something's going to happen and you think that like everything's in place. Pepe Marotti is exceptional. Conte is exceptional. And I feel like I'm just repeating myself. And maybe I am. Yesterday was massive. And, you know, it was um, just a hell of a day. Um, because with Inter now, the summer's going to be really critical. I think that Inter need to really back Conte, uh, Zhang and Suning. They have a feel for it now to back them, to push them, to really move them to the next stage is key. And hopefully they do that. Hopefully they do that with Gusto. You know, it's, it's really, really important. I should talk about all the Champions League uh, spots um, because it is massively important, but I'm not really. Because I'm excited, I'm excited for that as well. Personally, I do want to see um, Milan and Juventus get into the Champions League because I think that... Italy need it. I think Italy need. I think we have to look beyond rivalries at the moment with Italy. We need to see. The, I would love to see Napoli as well, personally. That just because they make me smile watching them play football. But when they play football, they make me smile, should I say? But um, I think that's what's needed. I think it needs Italy need to be strong because what happens is it's if Juventus is going to push into so hard now. You know, it's going to be a, a, a fantastic fight. But that's what we grew up with. Well, that's what, that's what I grew up with in the 90s. You know, the, the fact that Inter had that and then Milan come and cut along again. Okay, Sampdoria and Napoli before, whatever. But then Juventus go and do what they do. And it's just strong. And the more strength you have within that league, the more competitive... It needs to be competitive. We've seen what happens when it's not. You know, we all lived through after 2006. Well, most of us hope. Maybe, maybe some didn't, I don't know who watches this. But we all saw, you know, what happened. And it's absolutely crucial for, for Milan, for Juve to be, to be strong. Because I want to see more titles for Inter. I'm sure Milan fans will want to see more titles. Juve fans want to see more titles. And these are the big clubs. That's a fact. And yeah, so it's important. But yeah, going back to, to Inter Scudetto. It's, it's it's amazing. It's got such a different feel yesterday. And what's nice is, um, and this is, a, a, sorry again, it's a personal note, but you know, for me, the titles have come at really interesting times. One when I was a boy and it captured my attention. 
second was at the beginning of my relationship with my wife. She'd been out to event, uh, to events, no, she had not. She'd been out to Milan uh, just before we met, and I was in Milan at the same time. We never knew I was at a game. And uh, then we met, and our, our love of Milan, we've sort of, our relationships grown with the city, with the city and we've, we've had this interaction. And now this comes a time where, yeah, I'm a little bit older, and it's, I don't know. It's it's very. It's just a very nice feeling. It's a very nice feeling. It's one where it is emotional because it's you know you see, you feel like you've always got. Well, you don't live in Milan. I mean, you don't live in Italy. You feel like you've always lived a part of yourself there. And it was um, yeah, you know, it, it, amazing. And I go back to the events and I say it's such a credit because to to to, to be able to. I'm not even going to say topple, I'm going to say two, to gain a, one a Scudetto after all of theirs is an achievement because they pushed, made everyone work that hard and that's why it's so important and so impressive that Inter have done what they've done because you don't just knock them off, there's going to be a fight in the next 10 years they don't manage so. I'll get back to doing the papers, stop being so emotional and um, yeah, if you, if you like what we have done recently subscribe blah 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 let's go ciao for now